All right, everyone. Welcome back to another day of training. This video is gonna be all about the B2B, the business to business campaigns. So this is getting sponsorships, this is getting community partnerships, and this is all around just getting relationships with other owners and with other uh, businesses in the area, right? So for the past uh, few videos, I'm pretty sure we've been, yeah, I'm like this marker, this marker looks like it's a little too thin. So we've been doing it like this. I'm pretty sure we've been doing an intro, short story, a presentation, a close, and a consolidation. All right? So again, this video is about the business of business. So you really want to, uh, when you start your day off, you want to understand what areas you're going to go to. So number one, what areas? You want to ask yourself, what areas are you going to go to? Are you going to go to Carrollwood? Um, this is this is Tampa specifically. Are you going to go to Carrollwood? Are you going to go to downtown? Are you going to go to Ebor? What areas are you already doing the event in? Think of that too. So. Um, you know, am I doing the event in, like right now, we're at Soho and Julian B. Lane Park, so we want to focus on sponsors around there. Even if the sponsors come from other areas, that's great, but we want to build that relationship with the stores in the area to make sure everybody is like scratching each other's back, right? So what areas are you going to go to? And also, you want to be asking yourself, what sponsors do we need right now? Do we need a jeweler? Do we need a car dealership? So what areas are we gonna go to? What sponsors do we need? And what's my pitch? Like, what's my pitch? Like, how do I go in there and talk to them? Which you, your pitch should basically be the same for every campaign. So what does your intro look like in a business of business campaign? So I would go in just like this, dress just like this. Go in there. <clears throat> hey, I came for the free chicken. You see that joke? I came for the free chicken. What free chicken? No, I'm just kidding, man. Uh, my name is Nathaniel. I actually organize and coordinate big annual events in the city, and I'd like to make you guys a part of it. Who would I need to speak to to make you guys a part of that? That's your intro. And your short story at the same time. So your intro and short story is, uh, your intro and short story is, I'm here for the free chicken. That's your little intro, I'm here for the free chicken. Nah, I'm just kidding, but hey, really quick, my name is Nathaniel. I organize and coordinate a lot of annual events in the city. Who would I need to speak to here to make y'all a part of it? Then that person, that person already knows you just said a bunch of big words. All they heard was events and who I need to speak to to make y'all a part of it. They're gonna go right now to their manager or to the owner. They know they know to go to that person. <clears throat> what does your presentation look like? You already know your presentation is you whip out the flyer. So look, I don't got a flyer right now uh, because Penny Savers didn't have a flyer ready. But what I would do is I'd go to my phone, look up Speak Up Entertainment, Boom, the flyer's right here. So, like I said, my name was Nathaniel. You're gonna have to repeat it to the manager when they come back. Oh, like I was telling him, my name is Nathaniel. I organize and coordinate a lot of annual events in the city. I need to speak to you to make you a partner, right? Perfect, well, let me show you a little bit about the events. Here's one that's coming up. It's Taste of Tampa. You might not be able to see it on the phone uh, with the camera here. But right now, uh, like I said, we have a bunch of sponsors. So we have like the Levano Uptown. It's a community that's being built right now. We have Frontier. That's internet. Uh, we have Assurance Wireless. They got phones and stuff like that. Ebar, Ebar Love. It's an apothecary. They have like a lot of smell good stuff. Uh, like, like I was telling him though, I need to speak to you to make you guys a part of it, right? Perfect. So there's two ways to become a part of it, right? There's a sponsorship. And there's a community partnership. Right? 
There's two. There's a sponsorship and there's a community partnership. A sponsorship is $125. A community partnership is free. But a community partnership means that they're going to be actually letting us come to their location, to their store, and we're going to give out free tickets. We're going to give out free tickets in their name. So you have the sponsorship is $125. And then you have the community partnership, which is free. So we'll say this is a 125, and then this is free. So that's how you let them know. Because if a, if a, if a sponsor is acting like they don't have enough money or that they can't they can't afford it, you give them a community partnership. But the only way that they can do a community partnership is if we can come to their storefront, set up in front of there, and basically bother all their customers. But we don't tell them that. Like we're basically gonna every customer that comes in, we're gonna say, hey, we have these events going on. There, these people are giving out the tickets in their name. You know. So say it's Burger King, and Burger King is saying that they can't afford one hundred twenty-five dollars, which they fucking can. Say they can't afford one hundred twenty-five dollars, then we'll tell them, okay, well look, then we'll do a community partnership. But we'll post up in front of every single Burger King in the area and give out free tickets. That way, all those Burger King customers, now they know that Burger King does some cool events too, and also we get all the money from, from those, from the customers. All right? Now next, presentation to close. So the closing question, my closing question is, that all sounds good, right? I know it does. Now, like I said, my job is to get you set up with it today. Uh, so now you're gonna go to the, to, to the Speak Up Entertainment website and fill out the application. So you go to Speak Up Entertainment. Speak Up Entertainment. Dot org. The website is speakupentertainment.org. You're going to top uh, uh, hit apply now, and this is where you start getting the information from the customer. You're already on your phone with the flyer, right? So you go up here and you click apply now. And then you start filling out the information. So, sir, just so that we don't butcher your name, whenever we're uh, shouting you out on social media or at the event, what is the brand's name? Mama, mommy, fill it out. Okay, now, are you, sir, are you gonna be the one that's representing the, the company? Are you gonna be at the events, like working the tents and stuff or working the, the table? Okay, whose email is gonna actually be working that? Then you put in the email. A brief description of your brand. Say it's Burger King. Burger King is a fast food chain that specializes in hamburgers. They have all kinds of great deals, uh, like four for, four for, or what is it, two for six. I was gonna say a four for four. Then the website, boom, you're gonna go ahead and put their website. Hopefully they have a website. Then you put their phone number. Then right here, it's gonna say, who referred you? This is how you get your money. Who referred you? LJ, everybody's name should be in here. So it says Alita Marie, Moses, Nathaniel, Greg, LJ, Clint, Giovanni, Big Baby TV 813, Palm with Podcast. You put who referred you. Now, do you understand that you're gonna to have to have a setup for a vendor booth, like a tent, like a table? Yes, you have that? Perfect, you click yes. Do you understand that you must pay $125 a month as a sponsorship fee for each annual event that we organize accordingly? Yes? Boom, they hit yes, and then you send it. That person is closed. Now you consolidate. Remember, consolidation is getting the good reviews on Google. So you get the Google reviews. You get the Google reviews. You get a follow on social media. And then you just remind them of where they're going. Boom. You see? So we'll run it again. I'm going to do it from the very top without any interruptions, okay? I'm going to show you exactly how it goes. Hey, I'm here for the free chicken. I'm just kidding, man. 
Well, my name is Nathaniel. I organize and coordinate a lot of annual events in the city. Who would I need to speak to here to make y'all a part of those annual events? They go get the owner or the manager. Oh, are you the manager? Hi, how you doing? Like I was telling him, my name is Nathaniel Falcon. I organize and coordinate a lot of annual events in the city. I was trying to make you all a part of it. Um, I'd have to talk to you to make you a part of them, right? Yes? Awesome, perfect. Well, like I said, um, this is the event that's coming up right here. I like your shirt, by the way. That's a really cool shirt. Yes, sir. But uh, Taste of Tampa, this is an annual event that we have. It's a trade show and talent show. We do it every August. We do it every July. Uh, it's also a back to school thing. We have a lot of other sponsors. So you see how we have like the Levano Uptown. That's a, co uh, a community right now that's being built of like uh, wealthier homes, like $400,000, $500,000 homes. Um, also, we have the Frontier Internet. They'll be there. Assurance Wireless will be there, like hanging, uh, handing out phones and stuff like that. Ibarra Love and Apothecary. Um, like I said, it's a trade show and talent show. Now, all this sounds cool, right? Yes, sir. Um, now, let me go ahead and start you uh, signing you up for your sponsorship so that I don't butcher your name whenever that we're shouting you out on social media or when we're at the event. We don't want to butcher your name. Um, so what is the brand's name again? Okay, Baba ba, ba Jeweler. And then would I be sending you the email or would I be sending it like to one of your employees so that they're working it? Because we want to make sure you receive all the emails. What email would I put down? That one, that one, that one. Bomb. Now here, sir, I would ask for you to do this. Put a really quick brief description of what you feel like the the brand is. Go type it out, type it out, blah, 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 blah. All right, my brother. And then what is the website? Please tell me you have a website. I got a website? All right, bomb, bomb, let's put this. And if they don't have a website, ask them for a Facebook or an Instagram. That that link is a, is a website. All right, and then what is your phone number so that we'll be able to send you uh, any updates, we'll send it to your email and to your phone number. And if we need to call you for any reason, we need that. Okay, bomb. And then remember, who's referring you today? My name is Nathaniel, I'm the main organizer and coordinator. Bomb, hit that there. Now, do you have a setup for a vendor booth? Uh, so when you're there, we want you to be able to have a, tent, uh, a table or a tent that has your logo on it. Your employees should have, you know, full uniform so everybody is building that brand awareness. Okay, awesome. And do you understand that you must pay $125 sponsorship fee uh, for each annual event? Yes? Perfect. Bomb. Push it through. There you go. Go on to the next one. And then you consolidate. Now remember, sir, I'm signing you up to be a sponsor for Taste of Tampa Trade Show and Talent Show. Um, what we're what we're going to be doing is sending you an email and a message right now. You did say that you have social media, right? Like Instagram or Facebook? Perfect. Go ahead and whip out your phone real fast. And let's get you on all those social medias. Also, I'm going to go ahead and go to Google. Let me get in your Google. And I'm going to leave us a good review, okay? Because uh, you met me, so we're going to go ahead and mention my name, all right? Because I get a little bonus points if I, if I get my name on there. I'm a bomb, so I'll put the Google review. All right. Now, again, remember, my name is Nathaniel, my brother. If you need me, just call my number or anything like that. And it was $125. Did you want to pay with that with cash or card? With a card? All right, perfect. So let me go ahead and call um, right now, and then I'll, I'll get you. And then you can collect the money right there. You go to, to the Eventbrite. Go to the Eventbrite like, like this. You can just go to home and click on the, on the flyer, and it'll take you right there. And boom, collect the money. Collect your cash or card. Call me and let me know that, you know, we don't have, let me know about the sponsor so that I, I make sure we stick to that exclusivity. Cause you don't want to sign up a food truck or, or something else and we already have that, you know. And remember, there's so many different businesses, bro. So right now, right now I'm doing this at the library and I'm making the library part of the, the events, you know. So I'm waiting on, on one of the responses and that's, that's as easy as it is, bro. It's as simple as that, guys. But again, welcome to Speak Up Entertainment. This is your whole five steps for a business-to-business -business campaign. That's how you do it, guys. Peace.